Hey, what's up? It's Chanel. Welcome to a new episode of Vilo Vilo Vlog. And today we're going to be blasting Gruesome's Dimensions of Horror EP on Relapse Records. Amazing, amazing death worship. This time, Scream Bloody Gore error. They worked their way from leprosy to Scream Bloody Gore, then to human, but... This is so fucking good. You even have the Repka artwork. Amazing stuff, and what a killer fucking lineup. Seriously, gruesome as the fucking shit. I love fucking old school death metal, and who couldn't use some more death songs, even though they aren't death songs? This sounds enough like death that I kind of consider this. A rebirth without Chuck, and it's awesome. I'm not sure how stoked Chuck would be on this, but those are words out of Matt Harvey's mouth. He, they asked, hey, what do you think uh, Chuck would, would think of, you know, you kind of carrying the torch for death? And he was like, I think Chuck would hate it, but great stuff here. Especially if you like Scream Bloody Gore, Savage Land was their leprosy. Yeah. And speaking of old school death metal, today I want to talk about an underground gem. This is 1992's Disastrous Murmur, Raspides in Red on Osmos Productions. This is a total, total fucking underground masterpiece right here in my opinion. Amazing reissue, 10 tracks of killer European death metal great stuff and I love this reissue for so many reasons one of which is they did not fuck with the original 8 track recording there's no remastering none of that bullshit just straight up the way it was meant to sound on vinyl with this awesome tombstone insert it's fucking sick looking you have the band members down there and photos and you have Manfred Perec on drums, Walter Schwager on bass, and Harold Benzdeck on guitars and vocals. These guys are from Austria, and it kind of actually shows in their sound. Some pugnant stench definitely makes its way through on here. Pugnant, pugnant. It's one of those words I never can get right, and I apologize. But their influence is all over this fucking monster right here. Like, you have disgorged bowel movement, extra uterine pregnancy part two, dinner is served, trash chunk and garbage, mass killer, flesh is what I need, starts off the B-side, satisfaction in the morgue, into the dungeon, desecrating the grave, and drown in blood. All tracks are recorded on an 8-track at Tehran Studio, Burnt Taller, and it's fucking amazing. And this color illustration is by Ralph Manfreder. Amazing, amazing old-school death metal. It just screams no pun intended, old school death metal. Without even listening to it, if you just look at that, yeah, so fucking sick. I love that, like, xenomorphic alien just eating this dude's fucking brains. Amazing artwork. Just reeks of the 90s, and it's just fucking sick. Also, this is a complete complete riffarama. I, I fucking love it. Especially if you're a fan of like early suffocation, early gore guts before they got super, super technical. This is... You're gonna love it. It's it just... Oh, man. They take these like kind of... You could tell they were influenced by these bands, but they make them sound their own. And also by adding these semi-corny, but in my opinion, the corniness works in this album's favor. There's some keyboards on here 
not like pestilence level keyboards like just like every now and again you'll hear these kind of cheesy keyboards but i feel like they work with this album especially with uh disgorged bow movement i just love the way they like real creepily like lurk in this is so fucking sick sounding though because imagine all those early gorguts riffs but with these like gnarly fucking guttural vocals and it's just sick like as straightforward and like just awesome the riffing and whatnot is on here the vocal delivery is pretty guttural and you know more in line with uh, pugnant stench and it's just fucking wow every time i listen to this i hear something new and something else that i enjoy every track on here i think's fucking great you'll be banging your skull into oblivion after fucking tracks like dinner is served into the dungeon desecrating the grave drowning blood every single song on here is absolute fire seriously this is so goddamn good raspides and red i do not know why this is not talked about more in the underground because this is so fucking sick you can check out the rest of disasters murmurs catalog but i don't think anything comes close to how fucking sick raspides and red is this is just a classic death metal record from europe and i love it it's just fucking drenched in slime vocally and riff wise it's just man so fucking good i have no idea why this is still kind of semi obscure in most death metal circles but a lot of people know how good this is but in case you do not this is your chance to get into some disastrous murmur this reissue is great on osmos productions 2015 reissue and comes on this sick fucking splatter matches the artwork it's fucking sick i love it and again, this sick fucking tombstone. How cool is that? I think that's so fucking cool. Like, when I saw that this came in, like, a tombstone for, like, the actual, like, vinyl sleeve, I was, like, bugging out. I was like, this is fucking sick as shit. Like, mass killer, welcome to death house. No one gets out of it alive. My family has four members. We're all hungry for flesh. The dining room is painted with blood. The chandelier is hanged with guts. My face is so ugly. That's why I need your skin. Your mutated bones. Mutilated bones will be worn as pins. We gnaw the flesh from your bones as it's a fine meal for us alone. Shillings made from human guts, we devour it chunk for chunk. Total classic old school death metal lyrics as well. It's great. I love it. Seriously, just fucking drenched in gore and just that certain sound that just certain old school death metal records have, and this has it. And it's mostly to do with the 8-track recording. It just sounds so fucking on point and just great. I, I can't really say too much more good things about this record outside of how fucking essential it is in the world of underground death metal. And I can't recommend Raspides and Red by Disastrous Murmur enough. This is just absolute 10 out of 10 old school death metal reissue on osmos productions so fucking good 10 out of 10 get into it and we've been blasting the mighty gruesome dimensions of horror ep on relapse records i forgot it was an ep but oh well it happens you have six songs of total death worship awesome stuff matt harvey the riff master himself just so fucking good if you have yet to hear this, get into it. Dimensions of Horror, 
by Gruesome. Relapse Records. So good. And yeah, Disastrous Murmur. Raspides in Red. So fucking sick. Amazing, amazing stuff from Austria. Get into it. And yeah, you guys fucking rule as always. Thanks for watching. And get into that shit. It, trust me, it fucking rules. Hells. Ugh.